Hi there, this is David with Liberty Land Sales. Hey, thanks for inquiring about this really nice five acre, I'm sorry, 10 acre property in uh, near Christmas Valley in uh, Lake County, Oregon. We're asking $59.97, that is the cash discounted price, or if you prefer to pay retail uh, and terms, you take advantage of our seller financing. It's based on retail pricing, $161 a month though, still very affordable. Let's look at the terms here. So right here, if you want to buy the property, you click buy now, but you can also uh, select term sale and read the terms or cash sale and re read the amounts on that. But to simplify things, we did also just add this seller finance terms button for you. So if you're interested in seller financing, you're going to be paying a price of $89.97. That's the retail price. Uh, but easy down payment of $750. It's got a $250 dock fee. So all in a thousand bucks to be a property owner. Uh, no qualifying. You tell us you can make the payment and you make the payment. We got no reason not to believe you. So uh, very, very, very simple. You're going to be looking at a $161 uh, a month payment plus a $20 note service fee. That's a pass through for our uh, note servicing uh, program or loan servicing program. Um, it's uh, 72 months long. So if you decide that looks good, you want to buy it, you hit buy now, uh, change this to term sale, obviously. And then, um, so you've got the down payment here. Um, you'll put in all your information. Um, now it totals it for you down here, the 750 plus the 250 doc fee. You got to click agree and just fill out all this information. If your address for your billing on your credit card is different than your mailing address, then you got to fill that out again, unfortunately. But uh, get your credit card information, hit submit, and you'll be a landowner. So uh, you're doing the seller financing. Then when that goes through, you'll get a receipt. Uh, then we will, uh, within 48 hours is our policy, to send you a uh, contract via sign now for you to sign. And then we'll send you... <coughs> the link to set up your loan through geekpay.io actually will set it up for you and we'll send you the link. And then all you have to do is add your uh, bank account information for it to draw an ACH payment monthly. <clears throat> <clears throat> and if you need some help with that, feel free to call us up. We can walk you through it and take your info over the phone and put it in for you. It's not a problem. Um, so these are actual photos of the property. So it's, it's 10 acres. Let me show you the location real quick on the map here. Uh, so you've kind of got a, uh, if you click on view bigger map, it'll just open Google Maps. So you could get a, a good picture of where the property actually sets. So there's my pin. You got a, a county road going right by the property. Um, it's basically really close up to the sand dunes here. This is an old, old radar station here, defunct now, but you've got the Christmas Valley sand dunes, so you're real close to that. Killer recreational property, if you just want a bug out pad or a place to store your stuff, put a shipping container out there and store all your motorbikes, uh, your hunting gear, your fishing gear. There's such great uh, hunting and fishing within you know an hour and a half radius of this, of Christmas Valley. Um, of course, you're not too far. You're only about 20 minutes from town out of this property. And so, you know, you've got fuel and you got a general store in here. Um, you got a golf course and a, and then the Christmas Valley Lake. There's some amenities in here downtown. You got a post office and, and basic things. You got a church uh, and stuff like that. But, you know, uh, that lot is mobile home friendly as well. So you could put a mobile home out there. Um, you will need to do a uh, well and septic if you want water and, and uh, toilet. But uh, here's a great view of the sand dunes, which this lot is very close to. If you like to hunt, there's some great elk and deer opportunity in and around Lake County. In addition, you have uh, uh, waterfowl galore. You know, you're just north of Tule Lake. You're going to got, got that whole migratory area for uh, for waterfowl, ducks, and geese, and everything. Uh, here's some lakes and streams around, a lot of opportunities for fishing. So great sports opportunities for sure uh, with this property. 
Uh, uh, let's see here. Let's just talk about land use a little bit. Um, so we put some, some links in here. This is obviously our website, libertylandsales.com. So uh, the link should be put into this property. But if for some reason you get this email without the link, when you go to our homepage to search, um, just select your state and your county. And there's usually only a few properties per county. And you can go down here and there's our, our 10 acre beauty right there. So we just sold the five and we got a one acre left. Um, but let's talk a little bit about land use. I'm getting heavy on time. Sorry, this is almost six minutes long. I'll try to cut it off quickly. I hate long videos. But you got all the coordinates in here if you want to grab them to go out and video, visit the property. Uh, we, we do not do uh, tours because we do this all over the country and we don't have people everywhere. But you can just grab uh, one of these coordinates like that, you know, and, and pop it into Google Maps or pop it into your GPS. You know, if you pull this up on your phone, you can copy and paste it onto your phone GPS. And then if, you, if you're uh, some of these sophisticated GPS users and you want to walk the corners, you can plug in all four corners. OK, so this it's zone residential. Um, there is power not too far away and phone well can be drilled. Septic can be installed. The roads are dirt. There's no time limit to build. There are no. Uh, uh, HOAs or POAs out there, mobile homes are allowed if permitted through a land use process for the establishment of a dwelling after a septic and building permit. So basically tells you put in a septic and you can you can do a, that, uh, a, a mobile home. Uh, manufactured homes are allowed. RVs are allowed when camping, but should not be left on the property <clears throat> if you're not there. Can be used without a permit for short periods of time typically not more than seven days out of 30. So uh, they just don't want people making RVs their full-time residence there, which is pretty common in almost all areas of the country. Um, but, <clears throat> hey, for, a, for, a, for a, a recreational property where you're going to visit every now and then, uh, it's awesome. If you want to just put up a, 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 a home uh, or you want to do a mobile home, store all your toys out there, uh, whatnot. It's, it's great property. I mean, th these are actual proper, uh, <coughs> excuse me, these are actual photos. So you can see you've got houses and power pretty close. So it's out there. Um, and you can see power lines over here. Uh, it's out there. Uh, so you're pretty private, but it's somewhat close to civilization. So it's not completely out there. So depending on what you want. Um, anyway, if you like the property, Click buy now, put a deposit down, and you're a landowner. All right? Hope you have an awesome day. I'm David with Liberty Land Sales signing out. Thanks.